Hey guys, so today I'm gonna be doing an extremely overdue video. If you guys saw my closet clean out, I got rid of a lot of clothes that I just haven't worn. And if you guys can even see, there's like bags and bags filled with clothes that I've been meaning to sell on Depop. I've been extremely busy with school and just work that I haven't had enough time to like set a day to take pictures of the item, list them on Depop, price them, ship them out. But today I do have a few hours free to work on this because this clothes has been sitting in my room for months now at this point almost done with school and i'm gonna do a huge like closet room clean out and just like get rid of a bunch of stuff so researched a lot of tiktoks a lot of videos on how people ship out their orders on depop that's where i'm deciding to sell my stuff just because i'm super familiar with depop i shop a lot on there it makes a lot more sense for me to sell on there so that's where i'm gonna be doing majority of my selling i'm gonna be selling clothes for sure i'm probably gonna get rid of some albums some k-pop albums and maybe just some random them knickknacks that I have that I just don't want anymore. I haven't shipped anything out. I haven't listed anything on Depop. I haven't done anything. The only thing I've done is set apart the clothes that I'm gonna sell. I'm only gonna be doing a few sale batches at a time. I'm not gonna list all of the items up yet because I feel like that's just gonna be a little bit overwhelming for me, especially because I'm still in school so I have to like manage my time well. Anyways, that is the plan for this video and I'm super excited. The most exciting news is that I got reached out by Moonbin, which is a printer, thermal printer company. And I see a lot of sellers and people that I follow and small businesses that use this printer printer and it's actually pretty crazy because I was about to buy them. They re ended up reaching out to me and sending me their thermal printer right when I decided I was going to sell items on Depop. And so I think this was like such a great coincidence because I was looking for a thermal printer. I was looking for paper to print out the shipping label. This one is their Bluetooth thermal label printer. It doesn't require ink so you don't need to buy ink cartridges and it's extremely convenient. It's small. It doesn't take up too much space. This is how it looks like. Comes with the instructions and then this is the paper, the sticky paper and then it comes with some cables to connect it and then this is the printer. It's like a little white box and then the paper comes out of this side and then there's like an insert on the back. I think this is so convenient like sometimes those huge printers I have one of those like to print for like when I need to print documents and stuff. Those take up hella space and I feel like this is just a cute little thing that you can have like on the side of your desk and it doesn't take up too much space you know. I got the printer. I I got the paper. I also got poly mailers. So basically, I'm gonna pick three to four different items that I'm gonna put up on my shop for my first sale. I'm gonna do a little shout out on Instagram and hopefully people buy them quickly so I can package it, send it out so I can show you guys like how to print this. Hopefully this goes well. I'm scared. Shipping things out kind of scares me a little bit but I'm pretty sure it's gonna it's gonna be fine. It's gonna be great. I work at a retail store and I always love printing and shipping items that people buy like from online orders. Like that's one of my favorite things to do at work because it's just like a routine and it's very satisfying and I just like play music. I just like doing it. I like packing stuff. Let's start. Let's do it. Let's get to work. Hurry. Clock in. Clock in. Also, please excuse my messy room. I've experienced a tremendous amount of stress and chaos. A lot of retail therapy. A very bad one actually. Like a very bad shopping addiction because I've just been stressed out and that's the only thing that's been bringing me happiness. So I just have bags and bags full of stuff that I bought in throughout this past month. My room is gonna get better. I swear I'm not. I'm not a hoarder, but I am. Okay, this huge Daiso bag, as well as this huge other bag are things that I plan on selling on Depop. But like I said, I'm only gonna be choosing like three or four items for this small drop, but eventually I'm gonna be selling all of this. So if you guys wanna have updates on when I plan on dropping these clothes on Depop, follow my Instagram and also follow my Depop because I will be posting on there, especially more around the holidays because I'm gonna have more time to do that. I also, I filmed that closet clean out like months ago, but I, girl, I already have stuff that I'm like, why'd I buy this? Why? Also, I plan on selling majority of these for like less than what I bought them for. I would like to get money back for some of the things I bought, but that's not my main priority, honestly. Like, I've just been super overwhelmed with the amount of stuff I have. Like, a lot of maximalism, a lot of over-consumerism, and I'm trying to change my ways, but it's hard. 
it's hard because I like buying stuff that I like and I, I seem to always want everything. I recently saw this video of someone saying like, you don't always need to have what you want. And I'm like, that is so true. But also like, you only live once. Life is short and if that shirt is going to make me happy for like five minutes, I'm going to do it. I already have a few things in mind that I want to sell for the first drop. This is not the bag I want. This is the bag I want. Also, this is the cutest bag ever. The fun is only reason to live. Also, this is from Taka Original. I've worn their stuff before this is also from their their shop it's so stinking cute i also have a code for you guys if you guys want to shop from there love obsessed this crew neck is so soft i love it okay there's this one top that i bought from brandy melville that i need to sell right now this when i went to kcon my friends and i went to a brandy melville girl i used to fit in their clothes but like i don't anymore was really hoping it was gonna fit me because it's the cutest like coquette little top but when i came home and tried it on it did not go over my shoulders like so this is one of the items i want to sell it's so cute it's so cute but it doesn't fit me so that's one item the next item that i'm gonna do is this one this one's from urban outfitters it's the brand motel it's like a bubbly top i couldn't find a way to style it it's cute but i just don't think it's me it's really like comfy though it, it reminds me of like bubble wrap and i've seen so many people style it really cute like with a mini skirt but for some reason it just doesn't look flattering on me so i'm gonna have to get rid of it this is a sweater vest that i uh that i got from target it's the wild and fable i wore this when i saw p1 harmony in la like their free concert thing it's so cute i paired it with green pants it was so adorable but i'm getting rid of most of my sweater vest because it's not really my style and i can't seem to style it very well like i wish i was a vest girly but i just don't look good like i look not good i think this is a good start it kind of seems like a little bit but i'm also kind of like overwhelmed like i'm scared there's other stuff that i plan on selling guys if you guys see something you like please please buy it from me because i don't want it we're gonna start with three items guys we're starting slow okay this business is thriving sales are dropping i also need to keep in mind like it's cold season right now so i have shorts but i'm like no one's gonna buy shorts right now like it's cold you know so we are gonna be selling these three items so now the next step is to take pictures of them so that i can upload them to depop and then i have to include the size and the brand and any measurements that might be important for the buyer to know i'm gonna be taking these pictures in i think my parents room because their lighting is there is really nice and they also have white bed sheets so i feel like that's the best right wait but these are white it's gonna blend in man let me think about it okay i'm in my parents room room reveal i'm kind of scared because it's white the sheets are white and it might like blend in but i'm gonna try really quick if not i'm gonna have to find another way so i'm just gonna be taking it with my iphone this is the iphone Girl, I don't even know. 14 Pro. Is this backwards? Ew. It doesn't look good. It doesn't look good. Okay, I think I actually found a place I'm gonna take the pictures. I just went on Depop and saw what like my favorite sellers, how they take pictures and they tend to like take it against the wall. So I think that's what I'm gonna do in like this little corner. Or I also kind of like this layout with like the pictures in the background. I don't know yet, but or maybe, maybe like that too. Okay, I think I took some decent ones. I took some of the tag and the price tag. I think these are good. I'm probably gonna edit them because I don't, it looks hella dark. The sun is about to set in like 10 seconds. It's ridiculous. Now I'm gonna take pictures of this one. I think that was a success. Last item is a purple vest. I think I got it. So I have this little, this is my sister's, but it's a kitchen scale, but you could use it for like measuring clothes and stuff for like small packages. And you can measure it in pounds and ounces, which I think is the Depop scaling system. I have no idea guys. During my research, when I was deciding how to like ship it out, I didn't know if I wanted to do it through Depop, like the shipment process through Depop, or I did see people recommend Pirate Ship and Shopo. 
I believe it's Shapo. I think I'm more familiar with pirate ships, so I think I'm gonna do that one. I got poly mailers, recyclable. It will break down into carbon dioxide, water, and biomass, making it easily consumed by bacteria and fungi. So I made sure to buy like environmentally safe packaging because there's too much plastic in the world and it's ridiculous. And I got this like cute florally design that I'm gonna be using for shipping these out. I'm excited, guys. Oh my gosh. Let me edit the pictures really quick. I'm just gonna edit it through Lightroom and then like fix the color and make it brighter and stuff and I will get back to you guys in a little bit I did not like those pictures one bit so I'm doing it up here instead it's just too dark back there like the I have huge windows but they're literally useless like don't even get me started I hate this room so bad like it's not even funny but I took some and they look literally so much better so This looks so much better, y'all. I'm succeeding in life. Okay, let me take this last one, edit them, and then I'll go back to swear. So I think I'm about to drop the three items. I'm gonna list them and like put the descriptions and all of that. I already shouted out my Depop on my Instagram story. So hopefully these are able to sell quick. The three items right there. I'm scared to post it. <laughs> I feel like I'm doing a boyfriend reveal. Yeah, I'm nervy. I feel like I did everything wrong. And it was also kind of hard to like price it because I don't want to overprice things, but I also like, like don't want to like, you know? I'm also trying to keep in mind like shipping and I literally don't know how the shipping works. Like, like how am I supposed to calculate that? We'll see how long it takes for it to sell. Hopefully it goes smoothly. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. Businesswoman, watch out. Close the businesses, dude, CEO. Yeah, I also have wrapping paper and I'm gonna include like a little thank you note for shopping at my shop. This is so exciting, guys. Like, this is so fun. I feel like I'm playing house. Like, I feel like it's not real, you know? I feel like 20 bucks is too much. Guys, I don't know how to price this. Okay, I'm just gonna do it. Wait, I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Okay, I'm gonna just do it. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Guys, this makes me so I feel like I'm gonna be like on a Zoom call. Okay, I just need to make sure everything's right. Small, yes small model like no i'm gonna puke actually like i think i'm gonna puke it's live okay list another item done 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 post it i don't care i don't care eee! okay it's posted those second round of pictures were honestly a lot better it's giving business ceo okay slay we did it i'm gonna join my zoom class oh my gosh i'm late i'm gonna join my zoom class because i guess uh i'll see you guys later I finally got my first sale. <laughs> I ended up adding more items to my Depop because literally no one was buying my clothes. Guys, what's going on? Come on, drop the bag. I ended up adding, I think, four more items to like what I showed you guys earlier. And someone ended up buying this little black top from H&M. It's super cute. Get it ready to be packed. Print the label. And I'm gonna show you guys how I do it because it's my first time and it's gonna be a learning experience for both of us. I got the packing stuff scale and I also got the Moonbin printer that I'm gonna set up and print. I was hoping that more people were gonna buy items so I can do like a whole bunch of like packing and stuff, but like business is slow, guys. The economy is crashing. <laughs> at least i got one so i can show you guys how it is and hopefully do this video you guys <laughs> will buy my stuff guys come on like what's going on and then i plan on dropping it off at the post office tomorrow when i got the notification that someone bought my thing i got super excited and i screenshotted it yeah let's get to packing look at this little guy <sighs> Okay, so it basically, it asks for their address, the type of packaging, the dimensions, and the weight.
it's packing time someone ended up buying the motel top so yeah i'm gonna pack it and then i'm gonna drop it off at the post office today just to get it going i'm gonna pack it up a little tissue paper weigh it print out the printing label with my moon bin printer it's gonna be a good work day let's get it started Okay, my camera died, but I printed the label and I'm gonna go to the post office right now. My dad's gonna say, second sale done. Okay, businesswoman, let's go. I just dropped off the package that is officially my second package that I shipped out from my Depop shop. Yeah, it's going great so far. A lot smoother than I thought. The first package that I shipped out already got delivered and this one is on its way. Thank you to anyone who buys from my shop. If you like anything from my shop, please don't hesitate to go check it out. Or if you have any questions about measurements or sizing, don't hesitate to ask me. I want you to get an item that you're gonna love forever and ever don't forget to check out moonbin because that printer is literally a lifesaver like it's so easy to print i already got the hang of it with the second time they sell that thermal printer as well as other printers for any other kind of business that you're into or that you run printing paper they sell that too thank you moonbin for sending me your thermal printer i love it so much it came just in time for my depop drop my depop career and i just love it so much once i get into like a process and a more organized way of shipping stuff out i'm gonna do a more in-depth and detailed video on it because i do know there's a lot of people that want to start selling on depop or poshmark or any other selling website and i know shipping can get kind of confusing but i think i got a grasp of how it works so that video will be coming soon in the near future when i'm more settled in into this process don't forget to follow me on instagram at depop depop whoa that's not my usual script don't forget to follow me on instagram at tiktok and pinterest and don't forget to check check out my depop shop for cute clothing items from my closet that i don't wear anymore thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video also look <laughs> goodbye mm -hmm.